something else can affect and that is hydration. You would never think of hydration when you're thinking of oxygen. But under a microscope, blood cells look like this. They're moving around. They're moving it around at an incredible rate. But if someone's dehydrated, the blood cells clump. It's actually called roulette. Now, when those blood cells go through the lungs, they pick up oxygen like little parcels. When this goes through the lungs, how much oxygen is it picking up? Can you see that someone can suffer from chronic fatigue syndrome? And of course, that's what lack of oxygen is called. Isn't that right? 